Uh, Kia ora everyone. Uh, I'm known as Christian, one name only, and I'd like to talk about um, where the consent comes from and this thing about free trade. This thing about free trade isn't new. For us, it started here in 1835. Here's the trading flag. So this is just a continuation of this free trade. They have to renew and create a new contract every hundred years. And they've implemented that through the settlements. These settlements, these treaty settlements, is to action this free trade agreement. And what people don't realize is that the Declaration of Independence here is really not what it appears to be. When we understand the nature of the pen and the paper and how your free will and your energy is transferred from your physical form here into a fiscal paper, that's the free trade. Free trade in souls. And it's maintained and regulated through the birth registration, 1836, as a result of the 1835 Declaration of Independence. The other uh, Imperial Act that came out of that was the 1837 Wills Act, which says in there, if you look online on legislation, that all real and personal property by law shall devolve upon the executor administrator. Why do we have an executor and administrator? Because this is an estate, it's a property that was created by a testator on a piece of paper. That's the declaration. And as long as there is an administrator who is Sean Elias, Chief Justice, Administrator of Government, uh, the uh, executor is John Keyes, the Executive Council, and then you have the Public Trustee and the Māori Trustee, and through your birth registration, there's the consent. Everything else is after the fact. You go look at where the consent comes from, people. Your birth registration is what enslaves you. It's also what funds the corporations globally under the Commonwealth. Just go online and look at the uh, 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 double tax agreement with the United States of America. You'll see that your birth certificate is worth a million dollars every year and they are managing it and everyone's a slave. Colonization through the East Indian Trading Company. Here's one of their flags. They colonized the world. A trading in slaves, trafficking. All the colonies are called plantations. They were trafficking in white slaves. Let's get down to the real nitty gritties about what's going on here. Every day they're manufacturing consent. The consent was through these settlements. The consent is through representation. The consent is through your birth registration. Every three years they need to renew their consent for a lease on your property. Everyone's waiting for that land out there, this here, these are resources. Well, this is what they have authority over. 75% water, 25% land. This is what they come and arrest. This is where they get the consent from to take the resources. And what's happening now, because America is in debt to China, we are a subsidiary of Washington DC, America since 1835. So China owns us too. So through this TPPA, they need to come here and rip all the gold, all the oil, all the water, which has been consented to by the settlements. Hauraki Y claim, Y100, was for all the minerals. When I'm talking about minerals, everything is made up of minerals, even you. Water, hey, they sold that off too. They're selling it off now. That includes the water in you. The land, 25% land, you. We're all slaves. 
check out where the consent comes from, people. Everything else is just after the fact. So, what is the solution? Well, the solution is John Keys, under the Governor General, under the Chief Justice, under the Executive Council, they're all puppets to a higher authority. That higher authority is the um, uh, IMF, International Monetary, International Bankers. But they are under a higher authority too. The higher authority, everything leads back to the Vatican. Every corporation that's registered, that includes you, is registered to the same registry, which is a global registry, which is uh, monitored and controlled through the will court, which is all under the Vatican. We're all slaves to the Pope. So every corporation, every company, everything that's registered is controlled from there. And it's all done by our consent. As long as you use any of the services out there, you are consenting. You're using the money, you're consenting. So John Keys and them, don't blame them. He's told what to do. <laughs> and he tells us what to do. So uh, just a bit of background information. But the solution is in the people understanding the facts to have an informed decision. Where to from now? And uh, uh, all these acts and statutes, they're only guidelines. The real law are in the Supreme Court decisions. These are only guidelines. They use force to enforce those guidelines and people need to rally together and become educated in protecting themselves and each other. Uh, there is there has been a process there that's been there since 1835 under the umbrella of the confederations of the United tribes and that process today is being still alive but in closed doors been hidden away from the people and they're called um, Maori committees and that's been under the umbrella of the Maori council and the Māori Council has been the agent for the consent. Our own people have been duped by our own people. And they've always had the authority to stop what's been going on. Now under the Māori Community Development Act and the regulations is where people can create Māori committees. And we are all Māori. Māori was manufactured by an Act of Parliament 1867 where the Aboriginal natives and their half-caste descendants became Māori. That was to bring joiner to make everyone the same. And further to the reality is that the whole world is controlled from here. The whole world is actually controlled from here. Three reasons. Where did everyone come to witness the uh, new millennium? They came here. Everyone thinks trading and all that starts from Greenwich, mean time. Well, that line comes right around the other side of the globe and it comes through here. So we are 13 hours ahead of Greenwich time, we are 17 hours ahead of Washington DC, we stand at the beginning of time. Time is the regulator of everything and even banking and trade. The second point is the genealogy of all, all, all uh, humanity starts from here. So everyone here has just come back to where they began at the beginning of time. And the third point is location, location. Right. And the location is in the flag here. The cross represents time jurisdiction, which is trade and banking. 
The Eastgate identifies where the authority and the control is. If we're talking about uh, the Vatican City being the square mile, Washington, Washington DC being the square mile and the square mile city of London, well the square mile here is Christchurch, Latimer Square. That's where the control is over the world, is from here. So just a few points to um, invoke uh, people's um, understanding of the truth. It's all about the consent. Thank you, everyone.